This is AP News Minute. Russia and Ukraine traded claims of rocket and artillery strikes at or near Europe's largest nuclear power plant on Sunday. Fears are growing that fighting could damage the facility, causing a massive radiation leak. Russia on Sunday accused Ukraine of shelling the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant, claiming a pipeline had been damaged in the latest attacks. The nearby city of Zaporizhia came under Russian fire overnight, damaging apartment buildings and wounding two people. Claims from both sides couldn't be independently verified. In Salt Lake City, police releasing body cam video showing a struggle with an unarmed man who wound up dead. It started after witnesses told police that Nikon Brandon ran into a brewery in his underwear and tried to steal beer. In the six-minute video, police are not seen using de-escalation techniques, despite an order from the city's mayor that they must do so. And in Pakistan, deaths from widespread monsoon flooding have topped 1,000 people in what officials are calling a climate catastrophe. The unprecedented monsoon season has affected all four of the country's provinces. Nearly 300,000 homes have been destroyed. And NASA's new moon rocket is still on track to blast off despite a series of lightning strikes on the launch pad. The 322-foot Space Launch System rocket is NASA's most powerful ever. On Monday, it's poised to send an empty crew capsule into lunar orbit with the hopes of a manned mission to the moon within a few years. Robert Bumstead, Associated Press with AP News Minute.